uh, speaking with angels, reading. <laughs> now, I know at first I was skeptical about it, but, but then this lady, she said, uh, she said, you're being watched over by a little boy, and his name is Bobby, and he's got a bad eye. <laughs> I said, okay. <laughs> oh, that was pretty weird, okay. <laughs> but then, then, I remembered that I had a second cousin, Eileen, who had a bob nose. <laughs> and she said, oh, yes, 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 yes. The fog, it's clearing. It's all clear to me now. It's Angel Eileen, and she's got a message for you. And it is, every journey begins with one step. <laughs> wow! <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> then I remembered that Eileen's very much alive, lives in Kansas City, so I took my first step on my journey and I got the hell out of there. <laughs> you know, it's not that I was really looking for, for anyone or anything that was lost. It's just, I guess I was just, I guess I was just looking for some. I don't know purpose. Hmm? Just maybe some some love, uh, just just happiness. Jesus, so my answers, right? <laughs> I mean, I think we all are, right? Right? Well, here I am. Here I am. I am in my late thirties, <laughs> and I still can't figure that. <laughs> I mean, I have tried everything. I tried college. Okay. Tried the arts. Tried music. Tried theater. Oh, and then came the babies, lots of babies, and uh, well, then came the marriage, <laughs> and uh, well, then came uh, the messed up kids, yeah, then the messed up marriage, <laughs> then the divorce, then another guy, then another job. Uh, geez, you know, I, so I don't know what I'm really looking for, I guess, I guess I'm just, Oh hell, I guess I'm just disappointed. <laughs> I I I guess I just I'm just lacking fulfillment. At least at least I think I am. You know, there are some people that find their life's inspiration in a freaking fortune cookie. Okay? And for them it's just so easy. But you know what? I bet, I bet. I could feed my dog fortune cookies, okay? And then after a while, someone would come along, and then they'd see this pile in their yard. <laughs> okay, let's, let's just go with that. So they see this pile, right? And then they're like, oh, at first they're like, oh, oh, I'm so mad. And then, then they see this piece of paper <laughs> sticking out, and they're like, oh, look. It's a message from the universe! <gasps> Look within to find true love. Oh, from the universe, through a dog's colon. <laughs> She was in the hospital, okay? Well, she was old. And it was, okay, it was probably her time. But there I was. You know, I was, I was in the room with her. And it was late. And, <clears throat> and then in that moment, you know, it was getting close. It was in that moment. And, you know, I don't know if it was the medication or, <laughs> or if she was dreaming. But then all of a sudden, 
all of a sudden, out of the silence and, and from her sleep, she, she cried out, so fast! Life was so fast. And then she died. And I thought, so fast? She was 87 years old. You know? And I can still remember when she walked me to my first day of school. Oh, God, I was so little. And then she, she and I we used to bake cookies. And then she drove me to my first day of college. And that, Yeah. <laughs> 